Okay, welcome back to more Let's Play. Luffy and the Fortress of Doom in the last one. Uh, we got the thing to go underwater, and I was excited briefly until I found out that we are in an underwater dungeon, and I, act I had actually forgotten uh, where I had stopped, so I loaded up the, uh, the emulator, I mean cartridge, and uh, I was like, okay, let's start... I was, I was like, let's start... Uh, you know, it's just, let's fire it up. I, let's see where I was. And as soon as I saw, I was just like, fucking damn it. Okay, um... Is this, is this just gonna take me back up to the surface, I wonder? Oh, boy. I don't, do I have a Sweetwater on? I don't know if I had it on from the last episode. Let's just put one on. Is this gonna take me back up? Oh, man, okay, so we got multiple floors of this. Oh, wait, I think this is, um the floor that's going to take me right back to the, um, uh, to the outer world area or whatever. Man, I really hope this dungeon isn't too much of a pain in the butt. It's like, jeez. I really hope that this, I mean, I guess there's going to be a final dungeon too, probably, right? I just really hope that this game doesn't, like, take a turn for the worse right at the end in terms of, like, bullshit dungeon, you know? Okay, good job. Hanging in there, Tom. All right, cool. Let's get him healed up. Um, just use your magics. Oh yeah, I still have to use Rally. Uh, maybe I'll just use that on a boss fight. I kind of it it is kind of expensive, so I don't want to use it on a unless it's like a tough fight or if it's a or if we're like right next to a town and I can just heal up. I mean, 30, I mean, it's not a huge amount of his magic, and I don't think I've ever almost run out of magic with him, but I don't know. I don't know how long this dungeon is, I don't know how long, um, how much, you know, I don't know how much time it's going to take, so it's possible that we're going to be in here for a while. Oh wait, actually, I've still got, um, magic restoring items. I've hardly used any of those. I think there was one time where I used a couple, but for the most part, I haven't, I don't think, bought any, I've, I've, so I've got a whole, you know, a stockpile from the whole game, essentially. Oh man, I'm dip, uh, dipping into my last 99 smoke balls. That's not good. If this game had a like a nice encounter rate, nice as in like the opposite of inhumane, which is what it is, uh, I would not be worried. But we're just oh my gosh, I'm totally lost. Once I when I find the exit, I'm uh, we're just gonna go out. I'm not gonna stick around and get all the chests. I'm calling it right now. <clears throat> yeah, how could there be such a strong current just coming out of nowhere? Like, golly. Yeah, I ain't even about this place. With these tre- um, I mean, it's supposed to be water currents. It's essentially, it's treadmills for the most part. Conveyor belts or whatever. Zircon wrist. I'm guessing that's zirconium. Man, I do not know what zirconium is. Like, at all. Just drop the dumb opal. It's only worth a hundred. Why'd they give you that so le uh, late in the game? It's weird. Oh, damn it. See, I'm still futzing with the... Okay, it's probably for the ladies. Ooh, just for you. Okay. Uh, five defense and no other... Let me just check her weight. Man, 166? What a chunky butt you are. Uh, okay, so it's plus two weight, but it's five defense, so no, it's fine. Wait, why is this tile a slightly different color? You see that? Oh wait, there's other lighter colors over here. Maybe the darker ones were just against the wall, so it gave the, the game put a shadow. Yeah, see, like these ones. There's just a shadow. Okay, never mind. Okay, so the question is, can we get out of here before we run out of um, uh, smoke balls? That's gonna be the question. I really hope there's not. Oh shit, dual blade isn't here, is it? I'm not supposed to find dual blade in one of these chests. I really hope not. I hope this, like, I, did, was this going to lead to the place that had Dual Blade in it? Yeah, because it was in Doom Island, is what they said, right? Man, I don't know. My, uh, my point, though, is that I really hope that um, there's an exit to this dungeon. I hope it's not just, like, a dungeon and you just got to get all the treasures. And then one of them will, like, the one that's deepest in the cave will be the, will be the Doom, uh, or the Dual Blade or whatever. Because if there's no exit, because I'm going to be, I'm looking for an exit so I can get the frick out of here. 
but if this game doesn't have a... If the whole purpose is to just find a chest and then leave the way you came, well, I guess if I'm exploring looking for the exit, I'll eventually probably come across all the treasures anyway. And if I find the dual blade, I'll know to leave. But if I don't find the dual blade, I'll know to keep looking for the exit. I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna assume that we that we need to find the exit because we have to go to the island. We have to go to the to the island or whatever. How could there be an island underwater? Uh, by the way, doesn't an island have to be like like walk onable? Otherwise, it's just part of the the seascape or whatever. Oh my god! Really? 800 gold pieces? Ah, oh, damn it. 800 gold pieces and a dead end. Now I'm double sailed. Alright. Man, this place is gonna suck, I can tell. Okay. Okay, so I do. Maybe there's three exits. There's like three ways to go into it. Maybe there's three ways to get out, and I, the goal is to get to that middle one. Okay, so we're back here. I wonder, you can't run into fights on the, um, on the currents, can you? Maybe I should just, oh, you can't, son of an ass. I was just about to say, maybe I could just, uh, take the currents around for a while. Really? Oh, shit, I probably lost the sweet water, didn't I? Wait, I don't think I did. Okay, there it is, okay. I was about to say, because I'm pretty sure I've... Like gone into places and then left and then when I'm on the world map, it'll say Sweetwater ran out. Is this gonna be another? Okay. Um. Oh, I was about to say, where the hell is that gonna lead? Oh, hold on. I saw at the very top of the screen. I saw a place that I think is gonna be our destination. Yeah, looks like a castle or something. Ah, oh, damn it! Come on, man. Man, you know what I should do? I should leave and stock up on smoke balls since I'm already here. Let's uh, let's cut, and I'm gonna buy like five thousand of those sons of bitches, and uh, we'll meet back. So uh, we'll meet back inside the um, inside the cave dungeon, whatever the hell it's called. Okay, we're back inside. Uh, I didn't buy five thousand, but I did buy like five hundred, or I have over five hundred now of those. I got those four hundred, and then like ninety nine here too. So hopefully we should be good for the rest of the game. If not, then I guess I'll just buy more, but whatever. Um, it should be enough for this dungeon, I really hope. I also sold a bunch of the other uh, old shit that I had. Oh, by the way, uh, let's go ahead and use uh, some... Of I noticed I had uh, got some potions that are starting to pile up. Um, mind potion. That's the in intelligence one, right? Yeah, and spell potion, it like lets you cast more spells because you have more uh, MP, right? Um, I don't know. Let's just put it on you since you have significantly less. And speed, um, should I, I think Luffy is the speediest. Should I make her even more speedy, I wonder? Let's speed up, uh, Jiren. That way if I need to heal with, like, both people, um, then her, you know, it'll just help her heal, uh, pop off also. Okay. Power Potion. Oh, this is the uh, HP one that I keep thinking is uh, strength or whatever, because it has the word power in it. Uh, let's put it on you. It's always good to have uh, your healer have uh, enough HPs, right? Alright, and I think that's... Okay, that's it. Okay, I don't think we've been here before. Man, we're gonna be lost as fuck. I just started playing Metal Gear. Uh, the other day, and I'm already lost in that. I mean, not, like, super lost, but, like, there's just a door, like, I got the first two cards, and then, um, I don't remember if I have to go to a different building, but I, I, I also got, I got card one, card two, and then card four, and I'm not sure if, uh, you're supposed to get card one and two, and then go to another building, and then to get, like, card three and so on. But, uh, yeah, I guess we'll find out. I've only recorded the first, like, three episodes. So, uh, so I got to where I can actually go into another building, but I have to go through one of those, like, little maze sections. So I'm not sure if the game wants you to do that so early on. 
mystery pin. And I didn't, uh, I didn't record, like, I didn't try to, uh, open the door with it, so I don't actually even know if that door will open. But yeah, that's, uh, that's a really fun game. Uh, potion? What was the thing I got just a minute ago? Was it a miracle, maybe? I don't remember. Anyway, it wasn't important. Let's just keep going. I also gotta remember to drop off the, uh, the crown jewels or whatever. Like, if you can find this thing that's worth 10,000, you're the greatest treasure hunter ever. Oh shit, we're inside already. Alright, sweet. I'm a little bit curious. Maybe there'll be a treasure, like, right... Yeah, see, there you go. Maybe there'll be something... I was I was gonna say, like, right next to the, uh, to the entrance or whatever. Alright, I'm just grabbing this one. Okay, I, I don't give a shit, I'm leaving. I'm not... I'm, I don't know if there's going to be better gear. We did find the Zirconian wrist or whatever. That was five more defense, but... Hmm. I was expecting to be more sick and tired of being in there. So I kind of feel like, like, mentally, I have the capacity to explore there more. But I don't want to... I feel like if I don't take this opportunity to go in here now, I might not be able to find this place again. Uh, there's still air in here. Something feels strange. Uh, pause. Somebody... Touchling you or something. Oh, this is the place where we uh, started, right? Man, is this just gonna be the straight-up final area, I wonder? Or are we just gonna find the thing and then have to go to the final area? Yeah, I don't remember what happened at the very beginning. Was, was, was somebody like, oh, my sword, I dropped it down this hole. And now we're just gonna, like, reclaim it or something for ourselves? Yeah, I don't remember. Yeah, they definitely threw you right into the story. Jeez. Okay, easy enough. Yeah, these guys are not hard. Alright, you would level up. Cool. Man, 12 HP. Oh, man. 8 strength. Damn, girl. You go, girl. Oh, and learn champion? Damn, dude. Got so beast on that level. Damn. Huh. I wonder if I would have left these treasures if they would have had better shit in them. Kind of like, is it the... I always get the cave messed up. Is it the South Figaro cave? Or the, uh, or the Esper cave. Um, there's, there's a cave in Final Fantasy VI that if you purposefully leave the treasures and then, like, later on in the game you come back to it. If you come back and open the treasures at the later point, it has, like, way better uh, treasures in them. I wonder if that would have been the case here. Who knows? Well, these are some derpy looking... They look like they're made out of, like, Play-Doh or something. Good golly. At 95,000 experience, man. We ain't gonna be gaining that level anytime soon, no sir. Unless we find, like, an island with some metal slimes on it or something. Actually, we would probably need king metal slimes at this point. Or, you know, or liquid metal slimes. Yeah, when I played Dragon Quest VIII, man. To kill those, like, those optional dragon bosses or whatever. Man, you gotta grind like a mofo. And, uh... It's actually better to go after the liquid metal slimes versus the king metal slimes, because the liquid metal slimes give you, I think, like 11,000 apiece. But the king metal slimes give you, like, 30,000, but you usually only fight... Uh, do you ever fight more than one king metal slime at a time? I don't remember. Um, but anyway, they're more rare, and uh, so you have not very good of a chance to kill them uh, due to the rarity versus, like, the liquid metal slimes. You could fight, like, four or five at a time. And then, uh, yeah, I thought a cutscene was going to activate, by the way, there. So I didn't move for a second. You have, like, four or five at a time, so then you have a good chance to kill at least one of them. Was moving up what I was supposed to do? Okay, I think it was. I can't move to the side, so I'm supposed to just move up. Okay, that was a little weird. The hell is this? Is this a... Is this a, um... Is this, like, a, a horizon? Or, like, is this... Am I looking at outside? I think it... Yeah, something's weird. It's moving very slowly. It's not moving at the same speed as me. It makes me think that it's actually, like, very far away. And look at that. Arugula is so slow, he doesn't even get his turn uh, at the same time as everyone else. I don't even get to input his command until... Until I, um... Like, with the other people. Man, 162? Damn, son. Um... Damn, get that critical. Okay, we should be able to kill it. Alright. Oh, you son of a bitch. Yeah, I forgot they can do that. 
Alright, you're just delaying the inevitable. Your champion cannot, uh... You don't have enough HP total, man. You gotta get something that gives you some, like, temporary hit points or something. Or... It gives you a temporary max HP boost, is what I meant to say. You know what, we got, uh, high potions for days. Let's just use a couple. I don't think I've ever used it to see how much... Oh, wait, I think I did once. Because I think I made the comment that it gives about 100. Versus, um... Uh, stronger give, was giving about 80 or whatever. But I think that was the only time I used them. I got them, and we're close to the end of the game, so might as well use them. Okay, surprise attack, that means we're we're outy. I don't even know if I'm supposed to be going left or right. Oh, damn it. Is there gonna be like a big giant thing in the middle of this area? Really? Oh... Found a regular potion? Do I have anything that would light the way or something? I don't think I do. Do I really just have to... Come on, game. Is the game really going to make me do this? Okay, at least I got another surprise attack. I guess I, at least here I can tell that I'm moving. At least I can... At least your character stops like their walk cycle when they hit an obstacle some games have it where you where that doesn't even happen you'll just you'll just be doing your walk cycle into a wall and you won't even know that you hit a wall oh man oh what i i don't know what's going on with this i am supposed to be here right i really hope i wasn't supposed to find an item in the uh in the water cave or whatever that was gonna light this up. But why is the top of the screen flashing like an old Atari game? It's freaking weird. I really hope that the sword or whatever isn't just like chilling on the ground and I just gotta hit the A button in the right spot to like reach down and pick it up. I don't know if that's gonna be the case, but I mean, I'm starting to think along those lines. You still need a stronger. Uh, where is the goal? I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to press the button on like every tile to find. To find where to go. Oh. Oh, is this a new? No, this is just an open, uh, open area or whatever. Oh, shit. Did I find it? Did I... Did I do a thing? Oh, come on, game. Are you freaking kidding me? This is such a dick move. Oh, what the hell? Uh, is that supposed... Was that a glitch? Yeah, I think that was just a glitch or something. Okay. Oh, we can go down. Well, I can't even see, like, the staircase. Some games will have it where if you're walking around in the dark, you can at least see the staircase. That way you can, like, see what you need to work towards walking. Or you can see what you need to walk towards to work your way over to it. Here, I can't even see that. So if I, if I go into a door and the screen changes, I won't even know if, that's, if I'm going back the way I came or if I'm going to a new area. Oh, this is a dick move. Oh, come on, game. How do games do this, man? This is not fun. This feels like, um... This sort of feels like the way I came, but how would I freaking know? Was this whole... Hold on, I'm gonna go back. This whole... Is this whole area a dead end? I think I went right first. Let me just confirm that this whole area is just an empty freaking room. Oh, I can't believe... Okay, hold on. Okay, I can go this way. Oh, shit. 
I'm approaching the, uh, the bottom of the jam or whatever. The bottom of the little map that we're enclosed in. Did I use another sweet water? I don't remember. So for a very short time, I had a sense of where I was and where I was going. Once a fight activated, that went away. Oh my gosh. Why, game? Why? How is this pitched in the boardroom? Of, like, deciding what to put in their game to make it fun. I, did, like... It's like, did they have, did they have to, like, suck the dude's dick to have him include it in the game or something? Why else would they do it? Like, I know what will make people want to play our game and spend their hard-earned money on it. Oh, boy. Oops. Yeah, let's not do that. Oh, I got 26 revives. Good golly. There was at least one or two that I used that I didn't even need to use. I was kind of like... My giving a shit was at, like, an all-time low, kind of like it is now. And I was like, fuck it, let's fucking use it, whatever the fuck. And we actually still wound up with a pretty healthy supply, so that's good. Okay, so is this actually backwards? Am I on the right side? I think I'm on the right side. Man, this is not cool, man. You know what? Let's, um, let's cut until I find it. Because I think we spent enough time in the dark. I don't need to keep showing me walking around in the dark. Um, I'll just figure it out off camera. And when I get out of here, or if something happens, we'll just meet back then. Okay, we're back. Put my phone away that I was just using to look up how to do this. Apparently, you were supposed to go north... As, like, as far as you can go, and then go east, as far as you can go, and then it said, go through the door. Uh, I had to futz around a little bit to find the door. It wasn't a straight shot to the east. And then it said to go straight south, and then that's how you do it. Uh, yeah, I didn't, I mean, luckily I didn't spend, actually, I didn't spend too much time before I decided to look it up. Because it's like, I don't know, I just didn't, like, come on, man. Like, how do you possibly want to spend any more time doing that than you have to? I already spent enough time on camera doing it, for gosh sakes. Uh, oh, excuse me. Alright, so now we can see again. Boy, the things you take for granted. Good golly. Oh, at least when you're, like, stuck in a cave or whatever, at least you can see where you can freaking go. Golly. Okay, I'm not in the mood for your shits, uh, schnitzel. Okay, so apparently we were supposed to just go up. I mean, I know that was the obvious thing to do, but I just want to check for treasures. I should have known that they were just going to not be there. Is this the duo blade? Uh, you can't tell if it's, um... If it's, like, kind of, like, pointing downwards or whatever. I know it looks like it's pointing up, but, like, it looks like the hilt is, like, closer to us. You see what I'm saying? Because of, the, like, the perspective. Because otherwise, the sword is just really short and stubby. Or, uh, chunky or whatever. Just a little chunky sword. It's wider than it is tall. Uh, the Dewblade, it's ringing. We'll answer it. Jeez. Or I guess the, uh, the handle is, um... Oh, I thought it was sinking into the ground for a second. I was like, no! We gotta fight the Guardian of the Dewblade or whatever. Sinistrals! No, stone statues of the Sinistrals. But why do they pop up from the thing? That's weird. Those ones are Amanangades. Good work. Looks just like them. It means Deus and uh, Aram are at the back. I guess I've never seen them before, so that's why I don't know who's who. Tom, come here for a moment. This one? Yeah, you don't think she'd mind if we uh, just do a little something, something? No, don't watch, uh, Luffy. We're doing guy stuff here. Is this statue me? Is this me? Uh-oh. Are you a descendant of the, of the fucking thing? Are we going to have to kill you? Uh, this is Luffy, isn't it? Why is a statue of Luffy among the Sinistrals? Dun, dun, dun! How would I know? Oh, would you? Are you sure you wouldn't know? But everyone would agree that this is a statue of Lufia. Because, I mean, looking like someone is all, it is all it takes to be them, right? Actually, I saw a thing, um... What? Are you saying I'm a Sinistral? Well, no, I didn't mean it that way. I didn't want to use those words, but yeah, that's what I meant. I'm Luffy. I was raised by Roman at the Elekian Inn. I'm just an ordinary woman. I know nothing about this. Lufia, come clean. Come on. Tom, it's true. I really don't know anything. 
I know. How long do you think we've known each other? Um, you're Lufia and no one else. Okay, if you say so. Wait, could this be a trap? Is someone trying to break us up? Possibly. Oh, snap! Two of the real Sinistrals. Oh, three of them. Maxim's descendant lives. Dials, is that Dials? Dials? Yes, I am Dials. The waiting is finally over. The day of our re reunion has arrived. Reunion? Where's Aram? I don't see her. Aram was revived 16 years ago. Oh, uh, uh, uh. Did I, did, uh, did I hit my head and, uh, lose my memory? Uh, like in Dragon Ball? Uh, indeed, Aram is Lufia. Lufia is the Aram. Liar, you lie! Lufia, do you remember your parents? Of course not. You have no parents. They never existed. You are Aram. Like, oh, can't remember your parents? Oh, I guess that means that what I'm saying is true. Uh, we can use our energy to assume any form we choose. Luffy doesn't remember her parents because they died when she was small. So you say, but why do you think we let you live this long? Because you had to give us time to get strong enough to fucking uh, beat you up? I am pleased. You have brought Luffy back to me. What are you saying? Don't you see? Maxim destroyed us 99 years ago. Now Luffy has returned us to life. Luffy's power brought our energies together once more. No, no! What am I fighting for? It's a lie. You can ne or it's uh, Tom. My bad. It's a lie. Uh, she can never revive you. You're lying. Hear me, mortal. Look past your emotion. See the truth of my words. Go ahead. Ask her a question. Ah! Lufia, Lufia, speak to me. She is still alive. I only shocked her to unlock her the memory, her memories. My head, Tom, help me! Oh man. Lufia, hang on! Eh. Yeah, so recovery will take time. We have all the time in the world. Come. An earthquake. No, the fortress is moving. Tom, Jiren, Escape. Let's get out of here. I wanted to see if I could go on the broken stairs, though. Tom, Doom Island. I don't like the look of this, Tom. Let's head to the inn. That's so shit. I'm worried about Lufia. Is Lufia still with us? Oh, she won't even face us. Oh, she's asleep. Why couldn't they... Could they not splurge on uh, on having her eye close? <laughs> Tom, about the Sinistral said. Let's talk all the smack about her uh, now that she's asleep. Tomorrow, Rugula. I'm tired. I just want to get some sleep. Why does it look like those are just on the ground? It looks like the, uh, there's like no bed. It just looked like the blankets and the pillow. Yeah, same with there. Maybe they're the same color as the bricks and they just blend in. Or maybe it could just be a sleeping bag on the ground. I don't know. I mean, if I'm in an inn, I should have a bed, right? Uh, is this place so shit? I remember now. I fainted. No, you just realized you were a Sinistral, so you pretended to faint so that we wouldn't hate you, right? Tom, are you awake? Tom, what are we going to do? Uh-oh, we're gonna talk some shit and she's gonna overhear it. About what? Luffy, of course. What's wrong with Luffy? Stop living in a fantasy. Can you deny what Dale said? What are you saying? Aram's dead. All we have to do is destroy Amon, Dale, and Gades. I agree, but remember what Dale said about the reunion. Do you think Luffy brought the Sinistrals back to life? What are you trying to say? Even if we destroy the three remaining Sinistrals, they'll continue to return as long as Luffy lives. Uh, uh, like, oh, I couldn't help but over here while I was eavesdropping. Uh, if it's true, Tom, what are you going to do? I will strangle the life out of her. I'll watch the life drain from her eyes. I mean, hey, Lufia. Uh, we have to destroy them. Tom, do you realize what you're saying? Uh, you'll have to destroy Lufia, too. Can you do that? Well, maybe earlier on I could have, but she hasn't been annoying in a while. She hasn't been all angsty and stuff at the beginning. I was hoping that that wasn't going to be a thing, like when she first tried to join us, and we're like, no, don't join us. And then she's like, eh, they didn't join you. Truthfully, I'm not really sure. I never really thought about it. I was hoping that that wouldn't uh, keep happening, and luckily it didn't. Obviously, I don't want to think about it either. Are we going to actually have to do it, I wonder? Rugula, listen to me. What is it? Do you think Lufia would try to harm us? Why are you asking me? How should I know? Let's not talk about it anymore. We'll just wait and see what happens. Alright. If her head starts spinning, we'll just fucking stab her. Uh, let's see if Jiren and Luffy are awake yet. Uh, 
Ah, oh, the classic. Jared and Luffy, are you awake? I'm coming in. Yeah, you know, like the polite thing to do instead of just over like overhearing people uh, by eavesdropping. Ah, uh, is it morning already? Let's get moving. Let's go. It's too early to shout, Arugula. Good morning, Tom. Good morning, Luffy. Sleep well? Hmm. How's your head? Do you still feel like a Sinistral? Oh, okay, it doesn't hurt now. I'm fine. Good. Aren't you going to ask me? Uh, aren't you going to ask me? Ask you what? Oh, you should know. Well, you should tell me. No, you should just know. How long have I known you? You should just know. My memory. Don't you want to know if my memory's returned? Oh, okay, I thought she was playing some bullshit game. Like, you already know it. Just say what you said when you didn't think I was listening. Now I'm going to force you to say it now, just so I could, like, hold it over your head that you said it. You don't remember a thing, do you? No, but do you trust me? I don't know. You could be, like, possessed or some shit. You could just turn into them. Turn into the Sinistral and fucking kill us at any time. Doesn't matter. You're Lufia. You don't have to remember anything. Tom, do you trust yourself? Thanks. I'm fine. Well, if you're... If you could potentially, like, turn on us, then it doesn't matter if you trust yourself now. Something might happen. You might lose control of your power or something. I don't know. Tom, what will we do now? We're going to keep a close eye on Lufia. That's what the fuck we're going to do now. Doom Island is floating in the sky. The professor said that Falcon can fly. Let's go to Lab 3. Okay, so uh, before we do that, we'll meet back at uh, Lab 3 because I'm pretty sure we're over on time. That cutscene took longer than I thought it would. Uh, I did have to cut also in between, so I lost track on time, but I'm pretty sure we're over. So we'll see you guys next time, and we'll meet at um, the Lab 3 or whatever, and uh, we'll find out uh, what's in store. So as always, thanks so much for watching, and we'll see you then. Take care. Bye.